everyone, it's me, the Otaku Fangirl, here to review the final episode of Judges Bizarre Adventure Diamonds Unbreakable, episode 39. Ha! Huh. Alright, so you know what? It ended on a great note. It was, it had a really good ending. I actually really liked this part of JoJo now that it's all been wrapped up. So, uh, let's just start with the beginning of the episode, though. So, the beginning of the episode, we, you know, pick up where we last left off last week, you know, with Kira being cornered by everybody, basically. And you'd expect an all-out full battle, which kind of happened, but also kind of didn't happen. So, yeah, because, I mean, first of all, Josuke is really injured. Jotaro is too far away, but Jotaro did get close enough because there was this woman that uh, Kira was going to take hostage, and he kind of sort of did. Um, but then Jotaro, you know, used Time Stop when he got close enough uh, after, like, um, Koichi used, uh, you know, Act 3 and the freeze thing. So after, like, he pinned down his arm, uh, Kira's arm and everything. So basically Jotaro, you know, landed a lot of blows on him and injured him so badly, but then, uh, you'd think, you know, they're gonna, like, you know, maybe put him in prison or something like that. No, no, Kira dies. Dude's dead. Completely dead, because he got run over by an ambulance, and I was like, wow, okay. So, yeah, after that, he got transported to, uh, where Raimi was, the little, you know, um, area that she's in, and she is pretty much the one to do the finishing blow, and I really liked that. I was like, oh, you yes, 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 I loved that, because that gives her closure on her whole situation. That gives, you know, Kira his ultimate demise, really, and so, yeah, that was a really great part. I really liked that part with Raimi. I was like, yes, this is great. Um, seeing, like, you know, Kira, like, talk to her, because, you know, he, she was the first one he ever killed, so that, that was really interesting to see, and I really liked that. Um, so after that, you know, Everybody, you know, basically just kind of town goes back to normal pretty much after, you know, Raimi disappears and it's kind of kind of a, you know, a little sweet, sad scene there seeing her go because she can finally move on, you know, and go to heaven, I assume. So it was really nice. It was like, oh, yay, Raimi, Raimi is fine now. And, you know, she passed on and, <laughs> oh, gosh, Rohan, you know, saying that he's not going to miss her, but he's like, I'm going to miss you. I'm like, oh, that's that's kind of cute. Um, so, yeah, you know, her and her dog, she, they're gone. They're, they're fine wherever they are. And uh, everybody in the town, you know, pretty much just kind of moved on and uh, like for instance Jotaro and um Joseph um left on a boat you know who knows where they're gonna go now um said that Jotaro you know did a thesis on something so I guess he has his like degree in whatever probably marine biology or something because apparently there's that whole dolphin joke I don't know out swimming around out there I don't know but anyway um and that invisible baby <laughs> I guess got adopted by uh Joseph so that was the thing I was like okay then because the mother was never found and it was like okay then um so yeah and uh, let's see Koichi and Yukako you know they're got their little romance going on, um, <laughs> Josuke's, you know, same old Josuke, because he goes and, you know, wishes, you know, Joseph and Jotaro bye, he's like, bye, but also I'm gonna steal your wallet, Joseph, <laughs> that, was, that was pretty funny, I thought that was pretty funny, because, you know, he's still same old Josuke, same old Josuke, that was pretty great, um, you know, um, Okuyasu and his dad, in his weird form, you know, they're all just having, everybody's fine, you know, the town's fine, everybody's good, you know, Kira's gone, so the killings have stopped, you know, Morio's saved, it's all good, you know, everything's great, and I, I was kind of hoping for maybe a part five teaser, maybe at the end, but we didn't get that, and that's really upsetting, because that would have been nice, that would have been really nice, you know, just kind of get us hyped, because I'm, I'm sure they gotta animate part five, guys, they got to, you know, they, they absolutely have to animate part five, because I don't want to start reading the manga, because it's such a long manga, but anyway, um, I enjoyed the ending, you know, Josuke doing that final pose that he did. I was like, yeah, sorry, clapping. That was so great. Oh, man. But uh, overall, I'm going to give uh, Joseph's Bizarre Adventure Part 4, Diamonds Unbreakable, an overall score of an 8. Yes, I give it an 8, uh, accounting for story, animation, characters, and uh, music. And um, yeah, so <laughs> I don't have much else to say about this finale episode besides, you know, I want a part five. Like, I want a part five anime, like, now. Like, I really want that super bad. Um, <laughs> like, really badly. Um, still, I'm just so shocked at how Kira died. Like, I thought it was gonna be a full-out on battle, but no, it was just like, oh, gotta remember my truck. Okay, then, or name it, it's whatever. Um, so <laughs> Still, it's kind of funny, actually. It's, it's kind of funny, because they make him this really bad villain, but no, he just gets run over. <laughs> Gosh, that was pretty funny. But... Yeah, um, I don't really have much else to say. Um, 
Uh, let's think here. Hmm, did I cover everything? I think I did. I covered my score. I covered everything that happened in the episode of note. Um, oh yeah, there was the part with Rohan, you know, Mike and his manga and everything. That was pretty great. You know, he's still going to make his manga, so that's good. Um, so yeah, uh, part five, who knows if that's ever going to get animated. It probably will. It'll probably get an anime. Whether that happens next year or in 2018, we don't know. We don't know, you know, we never know what they plan to do. So, what do you guys think of this finale of Joseph's Art Adventure Diamonds Unbreakable? Uh, do you think we'll get a part five next year or in 2018? Who knows? We'll have to see. So, uh, really enjoyed this anime, really enjoyed reviewing it, and I will see you guys in whatever I review next. Bye!